Morning everybody, lovely sunny day outside. I just thought I'd nip up here and show you what I've been doing over the last weekend. Uh, I decided that I needed a, to finish this scene off really before I can put the cliffs or anything in. I needed a, uh, to make a river. Now I've had a look at uh, all the uh, resins that are on the market which seems quite a lot but they just seem so expensive so I just thought after watching a few tutorials on eBay on eBay, on YouTube, I'll um, see how it goes. And so, after about ten layers of PVA, um, I finally got there what I wanted. I wanted kind of like uh, industrial murky coloured water. So um, I'll show you how I did it. Right, I'm going to try and uh, make the water scene for the river. I've put some plastic, thick plastic card down where I actually want the river. Um, I've removed the stone bridge and then just put it back so I can actually mark, if you can see, on the white card where the bridge will stand. Now I could use the Woodland Scenic resin glue and there's all these resin glues um, but they do seem quite expensive so before I go down that road I thought I'd try the uh, tissue and PVA route and see how that turns out. This whiteboard is obviously I can take it out so um, if it doesn't work I can just put another piece of, piece of board back in, seal it up and try the other way. But anyway I'm going to make a start. So that's the bridge taken away, so I'm going to actually pull this out and go and make a start. Right, so now down, I've been allowed in the dining room as we're going to have no guests for the next couple of months. So I've um, covered the dining room table up. I've got some PVA, paintbrush and some tissues. I'm going to uh, water the PVA down about 50-50 and then um, I'll start laying the tissue and we'll see how it goes. Right, I've added the IPA, excuse my. So now I'm just going to get some normal rationed bog roll and start laying it in strips. I won't bore you with doing this, I'll just show you what I've done at the end. Right, there's all the tissue down. I'm now going to lather it in PVA again. Right, you probably can't see very well, but I've actually um, put the uh, PVA on top of the tissues now. And it's got to, got to leave it to dry for quite a time, so uh, it'll probably be a couple of days before I hear from me again. All right, bye for now. Right, well, it's now two days later, and as you can see, the tissue has totally dried. So now, I'm going to try and pick a colour. Now, I want it to look quite murky. So, um, this is a bit of experimentation. Sorry about that. Around the um, side of the river and around the pillars, I want to kind of like mix a bit of a murky colour. I know why that's gone a bit too dark. Now I'm going to try mixing it. Instead of mixing it with water, I'm going to put a bit of PVA in. Hopefully that will kind of like thicken it up a bit. Mm, it's cool, not more like a grey colour now. That's a bit too... So I'm going to put a bit of light green in this.
Like I say, I want it to look like an industrial river, so I do want it quite murky. But with this, I'm just going to go down the edges and around where the pillars are. I won't do all this because obviously it's going to bore you, so I'll show you what it's like when it's done. Well, that's the murky bit done. Now it's to find the right river colour. Well, there we are. It's probably a bit darker than I thought, but I'm hoping it's just going to dry a touch lighter. But we'll see what the texture's like when it's finished. Right, another day later, and I've um, kicked covering it in PVA. I'm hoping that the uh, form of the waves is starting to come through now and get that glossy look. We'll have a look what that looks like when it dries anyway. Right, I'll see you in a bit. Another day later, I've now put five coats on it and I think you'll agree it's getting better. A couple more and then I'll put it up on the layout. But there you go, I think it's quite effective. Save me a fortune, just some PVA paint and uh, bog roll. Excellent. Alright, well thanks for watching. Please subscribe and comment. And I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.